Genuine Lego? Did you hear the inverted commas in there? You sold? What? To whom? To me! Yay! Come with me! Stick our hands into this disgusting pile of secondhand Lego because you know it is going to be dirty and dusty and possibly full of needles and cat wee. But this one piece here convinced me that I needed to drive 10 minutes from my home, hand over some cash and see what the lucky draw would bring me. So here is my tub. Let's see how we went because I think, I think, oh well, I mean, I know. I mean, this is the Pop Stars bus. This is the bottom of the Pop Stars bus. And if this is still mostly built, surely the rest of it's in here, maybe, hopefully. But this piece here comes from an elf set. And I, it's one of the bigger elf sets, I think, but I can't remember which one. There's all, you know, there's a car here already built up. There's, uh, oh, this is a Belleville piece. I didn't see that in the picture. So maybe there's some Belleville stuff in here too, including some stuff that hasn't even been removed from the packet. I know what this is. That's the puppy car, maybe? I don't know. But though, this is, yeah, oh, so this is, oh, this is exciting. So this box contains hopefully all the pieces for the queen dragon, the Lego elves, dragon queen, queen dragon, I can't remember what it is, dragon set. But we have I'm yet to see whether this is mm, a full box of genuine Lego. Because this is definitely not a Lego piece. I think that's a Monster High. Yeah, so we will find out. The danger of buying this sort of thing is that you don't know whether you're going to get fake Lego or it's going to be filled with just random toys to make up the weight. But most of this looks as though, from what I can see from the picture... It looks as though it is mostly Lego. So we're going <laughs> to delve into here. I wish you had smell of vision because the smell of this is absolutely highly perfumed. It's horrible. And I probably should be wearing gloves, but I can always wash my hands as long as there's nothing sharp in here. So this base plate here is an old one, like really old. You don't get these in sets anymore. It's bent. So I don't know how good it's going to be. But this is from an elf set. This is like a lava stepping stone movable section. And I, I don't know if it's also from the Queen Dragon set. I'm going to just have to look some of these pieces up but this is a stephanie house window so if all of the pieces this is stephanie's dad this is oh, hold on it's not the right pants but this is stephanie's dad's top if all the pieces are in here i might get what is this like complete sets but i distracted by this is a horse doesn't look ah oh, the phone if you, i can see this but i'll see if it actually says lego inside the the hooves let me see if i can catch the light can you see that's upside down so that's this is a Lego horse. So this is a Belleville horse. I do not have any. I mean, these are so absurdly big <laughs> compared to what we have for Lego today. But this is a Belleville horse set. This must be a saddle. I'm going to have to look up what what set this horse comes from because this is super exciting. So if there's a horse in here, maybe there's a... <gasps> there is. There's a very, very manky rider over here. Somebody's tried to color her hair in. But she's still, I mean, there's no paint chipping or anything like that. It's just dirty. She's just very dirty and her hair's coloured in. I might be able to fix that. But look how she clips into the saddle. If I have all the pieces for this set, I'm going to build this on the channel. I need to find out what the set is. <laughs> so we'll find out in here. This is also a Belleville base plate of some description. And we do have a decent number of ba base plates here that are all in good nick. And some pieces that are still in their bags. What are these little tiny bags? Are they familiar? I don't know what they are. But let's have a look at the cream of the crop. We've got the Lego elves piece. This is the dragon's head. Yeah, so we've got the head for the dragon. This is, I think, the pop stars bus window so i'm wondering how many pieces we have here whether we'd be able to I'll be able to build the pop stars bus again but this is not oh hold on i was about to say this is not lego but maybe it's like belleville lego no i don't think so i can see made in china written on that what is this squeezy thing that's not lego <laughs> this smells so appalling but it could be worse hopefully we'll be able to wash we'll be able to wash this smell away that's an emily jones outfit so this is a sylvanian family's little stool from the fashion set and this is a car or a i don't it's, i mean it's obviously a car number platey thing so i wonder what else Wonder what else we have in here. This is this is exciting. This is much better than I expected it to be. So we've definitely got we've definitely got the Queen Dragon. This is from the Queen Dragon set too, I think. And this one, I mean, Regana's Castle has that. I'm so I'm, I'm so keen to have another version of Regana's Castle, but I don't know whether <laughs> we've got that here. So we've got a Duplo puppy, some really dirty rope bit here. Oh my goodness, this comes out of the original hairdresser set. 
Oh, this is like a find. Oh, okay. And the original horse trailer, like a really old horse trailer, there's another Belleville doll too. She's in better nick than the other one. She hasn't been coloured in anyway. I don't know what this... I don't know that this is an actual build... I think maybe that was some creativity ha happening there, but we've got a, an elves fox. Oh, this is just like, it's like Christmas, really stinky Christmas. That's not Christmas. That's, that's like a monster high or a Barbie shoe. <laughs> oh my goodness. What is this? This is, I thought this was a mini doll, but this is like, what is this flat headed thing? Its head pops off. Oh my gosh. This is so cute. I want to know what this, what this was. Is that its hair? No, that's a mini doll hair. Oh, what? wonder what that's supposed to have come from. Oh, this is exciting. And it's also like a mystery to see which bits, like especially the built up parts, which bits belong to <gasps> which sets. This is the, ah, uh, the, el no, the, uh, the elves eagle. The elves eagle. And that's the hairdress. Azari's like, oh my gosh, that is a find. This is really super fun. Okay, I think that belongs to the eagle. What else is here? There's more rubbish. There's a shoe. That's a Sylvanian family shoe. I'll put that over here. Look, <laughs> this is fun. Okay, that's that bag I looked at before. I'll think about that because it's very familiar. And oh, okay, that's a sticker from Stephanie's house. Gold wings. So maybe we have a Pegasus in here. One of the elves Pegasus. Pegasi. And that's more of the horse trailer bits. That might be a Sylvanian family's towel. Nice hair pieces. There are not as many mini doll parts in here as I would have hoped, but there's a few. <gasps> that's an elves pennant. Oh my gosh, there's something really sticky in here. That's a Sylvanian family's headdress, I think. A hair, a hair band. I don't know what that teapot is. That's not Sylvanian family's. Stephanie's mum's head. Uh, hopefully we find the rest of her body in here too. <laughs> <laughs> rather than just a, don't know what that is, rather, rather than just a dissected headpiece. Got a ballet shoe, which is not Lego. Magnety bits, a cat, uh, more pop star stickers. These stickers are not applied particularly well. They are child applied. Uh, a Wonder Woman leg, was that a Wonder Woman leg? No, Batgirl leg, I think. Not of Lego, a lot of Lego, Lego make, but we do have some good base plates here. More dress up magnet pieces. I'm just kind of, I mean, there doesn't appear to be any fake Lego in here. This is like, looks like fake Lego, but that's a Belleville color. So I'm, I'll check that out. Like the pink in Belleville goes light as the time's gone on. This is the hair piece for the little flat doll. Has this doll been run over by something or was this what it was actually supposed to look like? I really want to know. That's so cute. <laughs> I don't, I've never seen that piece before, that orange buckety bit. Ah, Stephanie's bed, that sticker's terribly applied. So I don't know how, whether these stickers, ugh. oh my goodness. Oh, that is manky, but this is the sticker sheet for the, for the, uh, for the pop stars recording studio. It's covered in hair and gunk, but I reckon I can clean that. So we also have a Belleville foal. Definitely. Yeah, yeah, definitely Lego. So, oh my goodness. This will make it quite easy, I think, to ID this set, uh, the Belleville set that we have the parts for in here, an old school kitty. Oh my goodness. And another saddle, which is not going to fit on, fit on there. Is there another horse in here? I think that's a Sylvanian family's tiara, a leaf still in its molding. I don't think that trophy is, yeah, that's not Lego. Oh, okay. This is a problem. This is a monster high mega blocks doll. I think, is it a mega block stall? Which means we might have some mega blocks in here. I'll have to check it carefully. So broken this down now. And <laughs> like I've washed my hands so many times. It's still so dirty. But what I've identified is these little bags here are from an advent calendar. So I remember one of these is like a, a ice hockey thing. And the other one was a snow projectile. And see, there's a part of the snowman. So I don't remember which advent calendar is, but it doesn't matter. They came out of an advent calendar. This is the kitten car, a, a junior set. And this molded, yeah, the molded car piece is still here. Pristine condition. Dirty, but pristine. Got a good number of plates here. And the Belleville things, there is stuff here I've never seen before. There's, I mean, I would have just chucked this if I hadn't have been looking out for it. This broom is still Lego. It's just Belleville sized. And these harnesses are for the horses. There's only one horse though. And I'm pretty sure we should have two because we got two harnesses and two saddles. I'm pretty sure we've got all the parts for the uh, Dragon Queen, but these gold wings actually go on the eagle. I'd forgotten that. So we don't have an elf's horse. We've got the little parts for the eagle. But this white horse actually is supposed to go with the horse trailer. And this is my collection, well, the collection that came out of here of mini dolls, including a random Maleficent minifigure. But we do have some elves 
characters. So we got the elves, mouse and elves, fox, the little bat, little creepy bat, and the elves, dolphin, which only came in one set, night of spa set, which I never built on this channel. So if I've got all the pieces, I will build it. In, I mean, look how filthy that hair piece is. We're gonna, I will show you how we're gonna wash this soon. But look at this, we got a cape. We got, I never found Azari. Azari's not in here, but that's her cape and her hood from the, uh, I think from the dragon, dragon set. But I don't know where this white hair piece came from. That only came out in 2018. So I thought a lot of this stuff's a lot older than that. These necklaces still on their uh, still on their molding. And this is Mia's Roadster, which I also have never built before. So that's really exciting. These came out of the elves set, these printed ones. These are Stephanie's. So these are that was sorry, Stephanie's house. So these are the uh, sticker pieces which are Oh, they're pretty dodgily applied, some of them, because obviously they've been put on by a kid. Uh, but I don't know whether some of them are so filthy. I'm going to have a go at cleaning them, but I can't wash them. But I will clean them and I'll show you how in another video. But this is what I got, which was not genuine Lego. We've <laughs> got, yeah, Monster High doll, this little flat thing, Wonder Woman's legs. <laughs> I mean, this, oh, got a random fingernail. Ew. Uh, these are, I've had a matching pair here of Sylvanian family shoes, which are filthy, but but still, I mean, they're, they're still in really good condition. 10 cents score, thank you. <laughs> and some Sylvanian family's accessories. So it must have come out of one of the glamour sets, one of the actually more recent sets, the Sylvanian family sets. All right, and oh, oh yeah, mm, a, a toothpick. That's always nice. Uh, but I think these sunglasses are also Sylvanian families. Those nail polish pieces are. So I'm not gonna throw all of these away. Uh, <laughs> this was the only fake Lego piece that I found, which I think is just the base plate for the Mega Bloks doll for her to stand up on. That's my guess, but I don't know. If you know, let me know in the comments. I'd be very keen to find out how it works. So let's wash this. I have put these all into garment bags and they're gonna go into the washing machine, but I can't wash these because these are the stickered pieces and I'll just wipe over some of these with isopropyl alcohol. I'll show you how I clean them in another video, but <laughs> this Lego stinks. So I'm putting them in the washing machine with a couple of towels to just buffer, buffer all of that Lego. I really should double bag them because Lego is really hard on garment bags, but we'll see how we go. I mean, worst thing that can happen is I can destroy the washing machine, right? So I've got some detergent in there and I'm going to do a hot wash, which is not gonna harm the Lego at all. In fact, you need that to get the grease and the sticky off it and hopefully the smell as well. And here in Australia, the hot water only goes to 60 degrees. We're capped at 60 degrees. So this is all now washed and I've popped it out under the deck because it's actually a bit rainy here at the moment. So under the deck on a fitted sheet to dry it off. It shouldn't take too long. And this look, see the Belleville doll has come up pretty well. So I will have another look, check this over, but yeah, it feels pretty squeaky clean now. So I'm pretty excited about this. So if I've got all the pieces for the Belleville set, I'm gonna build them here. And also the uh, Nida's Dolphin, the spa. I'm gonna build that too if I can find all the pieces that I need. That's so exciting because I've never built it before. All right, time to go. Make sure you click subscribe and the notification button, do all the things and check back in because more videos are coming up soon. I'm very excited. <laughs> all right, I'll see you soon. Bye.